solving logarithm equations using the one-to-one -one property. The one-to-one -one property tells us that if we have the log base 3 of something equal to the log base 3 of something else, those something else's have to equal each other in order for the equation to be true. So we can we take 2x, set it equal to x squared minus 24. When we solve this, remember that when we have an equation with x squared and an x in it, we're looking to make it a quadratic. Set it equal to 0 first, see if we can factor it. So I have x squared minus 2x minus 24. We're looking for two numbers that multiply to negative 24 and add to negative 2. That would be x equal, oops, 0 equals x minus 6 and x plus 4. When I multiply my x's, I get the x squared. I get 4x and minus 6x gives me negative 2. And that negative 6 and negative 4 give me negative 24. So that makes my x's positive 6 and negative 4. Now, log equations have extraneous solutions, so we have to check to see if they both work. Remember that the of part of the logarithm is not allowed to be negative or 0, so it has to be greater than 0. So when I plug negative 4 into this logarithm here, I get the log base 3 of negative 8, which is not allowed. So negative 4 is extraneous, and my only answer is x equals 6. So the next equation is an inequality, but it's still the 1 to 1 property of the log of x minus 5 less than or equal to the log of 19. So um, my log bases are the same, so I can equate what's inside x minus 5 less than or equal to 19. Let me get a different color. Um, we're going to add 5 to both sides, and x is less than or equal to 24. Now we have to think about this because if we continue to go in a negative direction, we will eventually get to a number that will make the inside of this negative. And what is that number that would make it negative? So x minus 5 must be greater than 0. And so we can solve that equation to find that x has to be greater than 5. So my answers need to be less than or equal to 24, but it stops at 5 because when x equals 5, what's inside of the log is negative or 0. And anything less than that would make it negative, so it's undefined at that point. And so this is our inequality, 5 less than x, less than or equal to 24. So x must be between 5 and, neg and positive 24, and it can include positive 24.